If you've ever wondered how tall your favorite stars really are, you're in for a treat. We've compiled a list of 100 famous Hollywood actors revealing their true heights. From towering giants to those whose charisma outshines their stature, we've got them all covered. Number 100. Peter Dinklage 4 foot 4 or 132 centimeters Peter Dinklage rocked as Tyrion Lannister in HBO's Game of Thrones, snagging an Emmy and a Golden Globe in 2011 for his killer performance. Number 99. Kevin Hart 5 foot 4 or 163 centimeters Kevin Hart the hilarious African-American comedian and actor is famous for his roles in the Jumanji sequels, Scary Movie 3, The Secret Life of Pets, and Central Intelligence. He made Time Magazine's list of the world's 100 most influential people in 2015. Number 98. Al Pacino, 5 foot 6 or 167 centimeters. Al Pacino, the legend behind classic roles in The Godfather, Serpico, and Scarface, is a heavyweight in 20th century cinema. With an Oscar, two Tonys, and two Emmys under his belt, he's nailed the triple crown of acting. Number 97. Ben Stiller, 5 foot 6 or 167 centimeters. He's the star of There's Something About Mary, Zoolander, and Meet the Parents, with his movies raking in over $2.6 billion in Canada and the US, averaging about $79 million each. He scored an Emmy, multiple MTV Movie Awards, a Britannia Award, and a Teen Choice Award throughout his career. Number 96. Aaron Paul, 5 foot 7 or 172 centimeters. Famous for playing Jesse Pinkman in AMC's Breaking Bad, he's bagged several awards, including the Critics' Choice TV Award for Best Supporting Actor in a Drama, a Satellite Award, and a Primetime Emmy for Outstanding Supporting Actor in a Drama Series. Number 95. Andy Serkis. 5 foot 7 inches or 171 centimeters. He's a pro at performance capture, bringing to life CG characters like Gollum in The Lord of the Rings and The Hobbit, King Kong in the 2005 film, Caesar in the Planet of the Apes series, Captain Haddock in The Adventure of Tintin, and Supreme Leader Snoke in Star Wars Episode 7 The Force Awakens. Number 94. Cillian Murphy. 5 foot 7 or 172 centimeters. Cillian Murphy is best known as Thomas Shelby in Peaky Blinders since 2013. He's also been in big movies like In Time, Red Lights, and The Dark Knight Rises, the last of Nolan's Batman trilogy. Number 93. Don Cheadle, 5 foot 7 inches or 172 centimeters. Don Cheadle is known for his versatile acting, bagging two Grammys, a Tony, two Golden Globes, and two SAG Awards. He's also famous for playing James Rhodey Rhodes or War Machine in the MCU. Number 92. Jesse Eisenberg, 5 foot 7 or 171 centimeters. He took on the role of Lex Luthor in Batman vs Superman, Dawn of Justice in March 2016, but it didn't go down well, landing generally poor reviews. Both comic fans and critics slammed his performance, even earning him a golden raspberry for worst supporting actor. He defended his approach, aiming to make the character real, relatable, and interesting. Number 91, Mark Ruffalo, 5 foot 7 or 171 centimeters. Mark Ruffalo scored a Tony Award nomination in 2006 for his role in the Broadway revival of Awake and Sing. He's also known globally for his role as Bruce Banner or Hulk in the Marvel Cinematic Universe since 2012. Number 90, Tobey Maguire, 5 foot 7 or 172 centimeters. Toby starred as the lead in Sam Raimi's Spider-Man trilogy and came back for Spider-Man No Way Home. He's got a Golden Globe nomination for Best Actor in a Drama for Brothers and set up his own production company, Material Pictures, in 2012. Number 89, Tom Cruise, 5 foot 7 or 170 centimeters. He's a Hollywood legend, bagging an honorary Palme d'Or and three Golden Globes, plus four Oscar nods. His films have made over $4 billion in North America and $11.5 billion globally, ranking him among the top box office stars. Number 88, Jackie Chan, 5 foot 8 or 174 centimeters. Jackie Chan is famous for his acrobatic fighting, comic timing, improvised weapons, and cool stunts. He's been in the movie biz since the 1960s with over 100 films to his name. He's got stars on both the Hong Kong Avenue of Stars and the Hollywood Walk of Fame. 
Number 87, Jeremy Renner, 5 foot 8 or 174 centimeters. Renner snagged Oscar nominations for Best Actor in The Hurt Locker and Best Supporting Actor in The Town. He's also known for playing Clint Barton or Hawkeye in the Marvel Cinematic Universe, including The Avengers and the Disney Plus miniseries Hawkeye. Number 86, Joaquin Phoenix, 5'8 or 173 centimeters. He's known for his roles in dark, unconventional indie films and period dramas. His trophy shelf includes an Academy Award, a BAFTA, a Grammy, and two Golden Globes. In 2020, the New York Times ranked him among the greatest actors of the 21st century. Number 85, Kit Harington, 5'8 or 173 centimeters. Best known as Jon Snow in Game of Thrones, he's been up for a Golden Globe and two Emmys. A graduate of the Royal Central School of Speech and Drama, Harrington kicked off his acting career in 2009 with War Horse in the West End. Number 84, Mark Wahlberg, 5'8 or 173 centimeters. His lead roles cover comedy, drama, and action. He scooped up a BAFTA, two Oscar nod, three Golden Globe nominations, nine Emmy bids, and three SAG Award nominations. Number 83, Oscar Isaac, 5'8 or 174 centimeters. Isaac's career took off with lead roles in A Most Violent Year, Ex Machina, and X-Men Apocalypse. He then hit global fame with playing Poe Dameron in the Star Wars sequel trilogy. Number 82, Robert Downey Jr., 5 foot 8 or 174 centimeters. Downey became a household name as Tony Stark or Iron Man, wowing critics and audiences alike. The original Iron Man raked in over $585 million, standing out as one of the year's tops films. Number 81, Tom Holland, 5 foot 8 inches or 173 centimeters. Holland gained worldwide fame as Spider-Man in six Marvel Cinematic Universe films, starting with Captain America Civil War. He's also bagged a British Academy Film Award and three Saturn Awards, also landing a spot on the Forbes 30 Under 30 Europe list in 2019. Number 80, Adam Sandler, 5 foot 9 inches or 177 centimeters. Hotel Transylvania 3 Summer Vacation tops Adam Sandler's movies with a $528 million box office. Sandler's known for hit comedies like Happy Gilmore, The Wedding Singer, and Big Daddy. He's also shown his range in dramas like Spanglish and Punch Drunk Love. Number 79, Anthony Hopkins, 5 foot 9 inches or 175 centimeters. Hopkins grabbed both critical and audience praise as Hannibal Lecter in The Silence of the Lambs, winning the 1991 Best Actor Oscar alongside Jodie Foster's Best Actress win as Clarice Starling. Number 78, Jack Nicholson, 5 foot 9 inches or 177 centimeters. In his five-decade career, Jack Nicholson starred in 80 films, earning three Oscars, three BAFTAs, six Golden Globes, a Grammy, and a SAG Award. He also received the AFI's Life Achievement Award in 1994 and the Kennedy Center Honor in 2001. Number 77, Mel Gibson, 5 foot 9 inches or 177 centimeters. Mel Gibson has starred in 43 films, including the Mad Max and Lethal Weapon series. Besides acting, he's directed four movies like Braveheart and The Passion of the Christ, produced 11 films, and written two. Number 76, Robert De Niro, 5 foot 9 inches or 177 centimeters. De Niro made his mark as a fiery actor in Mean Streets, his first film with Martin Scorsese. He snagged the Best Supporting Actor Oscar for The Godfather Part II and was nominated for three more. He won Best Actor for playing Jake Malamada in Raging Bull. Number 75, Sylvester Stallone, 5 foot 9 inches or 177 centimeters. Sylvester Stallone has racked up a bunch of awards, including a Golden Globe, three Oscar nominations, and two BAFTA nods. He's one of only two actors to star in a number one box office hit in six consecutive decades. Number 74, Tom Hardy, 5'9 or 175 centimeters. He's been in three Christopher Nolan movies, Inception, The Dark Knight Rises as Bane, and Dunkirk. More recently, he starred as Eddie Brock or Venom in Venom and its sequel, Venom, Let There Be Carnage. 
Number 73, Willem Dafoe, 5 foot 9 inches or 175 centimeters. Dafoe made a splash in big budget films like Spider Man and its sequels as the Green Goblin, the Finding Nemo series voicing a fish, and in the Life Aquatic with Steve Zissou, Wes Anderson's quirky comedy about a marine documentary crew. Number 72, Andrew Garfield, 5 foot 10 inches or 179 centimeters. Garfield started out on stage and shot to fame with movies like The Social Network and The Amazing Spider-Man. He made a cool comeback, joining former and current Spider-Man Tobey Maguire and Tom Holland in Spider-Man No Way Home. Number 71, Anthony Mackie, 5 foot 10 or 179 centimeters. He gained worldwide fame as Sam Wilson or Falcon in the Marvel Cinematic Universe, starting with Captain America the Winter Soldier, and recently in the Falcon and the Winter Soldier miniseries on Disney+. He sent to headline his own movie, Captain America Brave New World, in 2024. Number 70, Chiwetel Geofor, 5 foot 10 inches or 178 centimeters. He became well known in the 2000s with roles in Dirty Pretty Things, Love Actually, and Kinky Boots. He earned acclaim for 12 Years a Slave, directed his own movie, and appeared in the big Marvel Cinematic Universe films. Number 69, Colin Farrell. 5 foot 10 inches or 178 centimeters. Farrell grabbed a Golden Globe for In Bridges and got another nod for The Lobster. Recently, he's been in Sofia Coppola's The Beguiled and the live action remake of Disney's Dumbo. Number 68, Daniel Craig, 5 foot 10 or 178 centimeters. Daniel Craig became a global sensation as James Bond, beginning with Casino Royale in 2006 and starring in four more Bond films up to No Time to Die in 2021. Number 67, Jamie Foxx, 5 foot 10 or 178 centimeters. Jamie Foxx won an Academy Award for Best Actor, BAFTA Award for Best Actor in a Leading Role, and Golden Globe Award for Best Actor in a Musical or Comedy for his work in the biographical film Rain, 2004. Number 66, Jason Statham, 5 foot 10 inches or 178 centimeters. He starred as Lee Christmas in the Expendable series, The Comedy Spy, and played Deckard Shaw in the Fast and Furious franchise from Fast and Furious 6 to Hobbs and Shaw. He also appeared in B-movies like Homefront. Number 65, Johnny Depp, 5 foot 10 inches or 178 centimeters. Johnny Depp is famed for playing unique, quirky roles like Jack Sparrow in Pirates of the Caribbean, Raul Duke in Fear and Loathing in Las Vegas, and Ichabod Crane in Sleepy Hollow. Number 64, Jude Law, 5 foot 10 or 178 centimeters. Law is famous for his roles in big movie franchises. He played Dr. Watson in the Sherlock Holmes films, Albus Dumbledore in the Fantastic Beasts series, and Jan Rogg in Captain Marvel, a key part of the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Number 63, Matt Damon, 5 foot 10 or 178 centimeters. Damon's career spans a variety of films, from Saving Private Ryan and Ocean's Eleven to The Departed and The Martian. He also became a surprise action star as Jason Bourne in The Bourne Identity and its hit sequels. Number 62, Paul Rudd, 5 foot 10 inches or 178 centimeters. Paul Rudd is best known for his charming portrayal of Scott Lang, also known as Ant-Man. He first appeared in Ant-Man, winning over fans and making repeat appearances in the MCU, including in Captain America Civil War, Ant-Man and the Wasp, and the blockbuster Avengers Endgame. Number 61, Pedro Pascal, 5 foot 10 inches or 179 centimeters. Pascal, a Chilean American actor, first gained major attention playing Oberyn Martell in HBO's Game of Thrones in 2014. In 2023, he was nominated for a Primetime Emmy for his role in The Last of Us, marking him as only the second Latino to be up for Outstanding Lead Actor in a Drama Series. Number 60, Sam Worthington, 5 foot 10 inches or 178 centimeters. Worthington quickly became well-known and starred in big films like Clash of the Titans, The Debt, Texas Killing Fields, Man on a Ledge, and Wrath of the Titans. He also lent his voice to the Call of Duty Black Ops video games. Number 59, Aaron Eckhart, 5 foot 11 or 180 centimeters. 
Eckhart starred in the dark family drama Rabbit Hole and Clint Eastwood's aviation biopic Sully with crowd-pleasing work and hits including the terrorist drama Olympus Has Fallen and its sequel London Has Fallen. Number 58, Aaron Taylor Johnson, 5 foot 11 inches or 180 centimeters. He caught the world's eye with his touching role as a young John Lennon in Nowhere Boy and then won over comic book enthusiasts as a high school vigilante in Kick Ass. His roles in The Edgy Savages and the opulent Anna Karenina showed me he was quickly becoming a big deal in acting. Number 57, Brad Pitt, 5 foot 11 inches or 180 centimeters. Brad Pitt's role as Achilles in the 2004 epic movie Troy really boosted his image as an action hero. Not long after, he snagged a cool part in the slick spy movie Mr. and Mrs. Smith in 2005. Number 56, George Clooney, 5 feet 11 inches or 180 centimeters. George Clooney's Oscar win for playing a disenchanted CIA agent in Syriana, his role as a cynical exec up in the air, and as a grieving dad in The Descendants shattered any ideas that he was just a fun-loving bachelor. Number 55, Jake Gyllenhaal, 5 feet 11 inches or 182 centimeters. Jake Gyllenhaal started acting young, debuting in City Slickers and appearing in his dad's movies like The Dangerous Woman and Homegrown. His standout films include October Sky, Donnie Darko, Lovely and Amazing, Zodiac, Source Code, End of Watch, Nightcrawler, and Stronger. Number 54, James Franco. 5 feet 11 inches or 180 centimeters. James missed out on his main role to Tobey Maguire, but he ended up playing Harry Osborn, Spider-Man's best bud in the blockbuster Spider-Man in 2002. He kept playing Osborn in the next two movies of the trilogy. Number 53, Jared Leto, 5 foot 11 inches or 180 centimeters. Jared Leto became famous as Jordan Catalano in My So-Called Life. He's been in movies like Fight Club, Girl Interrupted, Panic Room, American Psycho, Alexander, Lord of War, Prefontaine, and Mr. Nobody. Number 52, Justin Timberlake, 5 foot 11 inches or 182 centimeters. Justin Timberlake broke the boy band mold with four number one solo albums and several Grammys. He also earned respect in acting with roles in The Social Network in 2011 and Trolls in 2016. Number 51, Russell Crowe, 5 foot 11 inches or 182 centimeters. Russell Crowe got global attention as a detective in LA Confidential and as Jeffrey Wingen in The Insider. He became more famous as the lead in Gladiator, winning an Oscar for Best Actor. Number 50, Vin Diesel, 5 foot 11 inches or 182 centimeters. He nailed his big break as the anti hero Riddick in Pitch Black that year. Diesel hit action hero fame with roles like Dominic Toretto in The Fast and the Furious and Xander Cage in Triple X. Number 49, Benedict Cumberbatch, 6 foot or 183 centimeters. He became super popular as a modern Sherlock Holmes, bagging awards like a BAFTA, a Primetime Emmy, and a Laurence Olivier Award, plus nominations for two Oscars and four Golden Globes. Number 48, Channing Tatum, 6 foot or 184 centimeters. Channing Tatum burst onto the scene in the 2006 dance movie Step Up. He grabbed more spotlight in She's the Man, Magic Mike, and its sequels, which he also produced, and in Jump Street and 22 Jump Street. Number 47, Chris Evans, six foot or 183 centimeters. Chris Evans became way more famous playing Steve Rogers, also known as Captain America, in a bunch of Marvel movies starting from Captain America the First Avenger to Avengers Endgame. This role made him one of the top paid actors around. Number 46, Chris Pine, 6 foot or 184 centimeters. He first hit the big screen with Anne Hathaway in The Princess Diaries 2, Royal Engagement. In 2017, he starred as Steve Trevor alongside Gal Gadot in Wonder Woman, which turned out to be his highest grossing film in the US. Number 45, Christian Bale, 6 foot or 183 centimeters. In 2005, he took on the role of Batman in Batman Begins, 
and continued in The Dark Knight and The Dark Knight Rises. His performance in this trilogy, one of the top grossing franchises, was highly praised. Number 44. Jonathan Majors, 6 foot or 183 centimeters. He kicked off his acting career in the ABC miniseries When We Rise and quickly grabbed significant roles, marking him as a rising Hollywood star. His role as Montgomery Allen in The Last Black Man in San Francisco earned him nominations for a Gotham Award and an Independent Spirit Award. Number 43, Leonardo DiCaprio, 6 foot or 183 centimeters. He earned his first Oscar and Golden Globe nominations for playing a developmentally disabled boy in What's Eating Gilbert Grape. DiCaprio shot to international fame with lead roles in Romeo and Juliet and Titanic. Number 42, Lawrence Fishburne, 6 foot or 183 centimeters. Lawrence Fishburne is known for his intense acting. He won a Tony Award in 1992 for Two Trains Running by August Wilson, but he's probably most famous for playing Morpheus in the Matrix trilogy. Number 41, Mads Mikkelsen, 6 foot or 183 centimeter. He shot the fame starring in the police series Unit 1, which snagged an international Emmy. His role in Open Arms earned him a Zulu Award and nominations in 2003. In Green Butchers, he was nominated for Robert and Fodel Awards in 2005. Number 40, Nicolas Cage, 6 foot or 183 centimeters. Nicolas Cage won an Oscar for Leaving Las Vegas. Some of his standout films include Kick-Ass, about a teen dreaming to be a superhero, and the Ghost Rider series, where he played a demonically possessed biker. Number 39, Patrick Wilson, 6 foot or 183 centimeters. He got famous for leading roles in the Insidious movies and as Ed Warren in the Conjuring series, both horror hits. He also made his first move into directing with Insidious, The Red Door. Number 38, Paul Dano, 6 foot or 184 centimeter. He nailed a standout supporting role as a fiery preacher with Daniel Day-Lewis in There Will Be Blood. Dano then voiced Alexander in Where the Wild Things Are and played unique characters in indie films like Gigantic, Taking Woodstock, The Good Heart, and The Extra Man. Number 37, Ryan Gosling, 6 foot or 184 centimeters. He's big in indie films and major studio movies of all kinds, with his films raking in over $1.9 billion globally. His big break came as a Jewish neo-Nazi in The Believer, and he shot to fame with the 2004 romantic drama The Notebook. Number 36, Sebastian Stan. 6 foot or 183 centimeters. He got popular playing Bucky Barnes, aka the Winter Soldier, in the Marvel Cinematic Universe, starting with Captain America, the first Avenger, and recently in the Disney Plus series, The Falcon and the Winter Soldier. Number 35, Sam Neill, 6 foot or 183 centimeters. He's famous for roles in Jurassic Park and the Oscar winning The Piano by Jane Champion. He got Emmy and Golden Globe nods for Merlin and was named Best Actor by the British Academy of Film and Television for Riley. Sam also won an AFI award for Best Actor in Jessica. Number 34, Tom Hanks, 6 foot or 183 centimeter. Tom Hanks became a big name with Big. He snagged the 1993 Best Actor Oscar for Philadelphia and then another for Forrest Gump, making him one of the few to win back-to-back -back Best Actor Oscars. Number 33, Adrian Brody, 6 foot 1 or 185 centimeters. Brody won the Best Actor Oscar for playing Vladislaw Spilman in Roman Polanski's The Pianist. This also earned him the Cesar Award for Best Actor. Number 32, Bradley Cooper, 6 foot 1 or 185 centimeters. Cooper really hit it big with roles in He's Just Not That Into You. The Hangover, and Valentine's Day. He was in the action movie The A-Team and starred in the thriller Limitless. Plus, he voiced Rocket Raccoon in Guardians of the Galaxy, which was the third top-grossing movie of 2014. Number 31, Denzel Washington, 6 foot 1 or 185 centimeter. Washington has snagged two Oscars, two Golden Globes, and a Tony Award. He's known for winning Best Supporting Actor for Glory in 1989 and Best Actor in 2001 for Training Day. 
Number 30, Henry Cavill, 6 foot 1 or 185 centimeters. He's famous as Superman in the DC Extended Universe and Geralt of Rivia in Netflix's The Witcher. He also starred in action spy movies like The Man from Uncle and Mission Impossible Fallout. Number 29, Jason Clark, 6 foot 1 or 185 centimeters. Clark had a big role in Lawless in 2012 played George Wilson in 2013's The Great Gatsby, and was the villain Emil Stentz in White House Down 2013. In 2014, he appeared as Malcolm in Dawn of the Planet of the Apes. Number 28, John Cena, 6 foot 1 or 185 centimeters. Cena first appeared in The Marine and received acclaim for roles in Trainwreck, Ferdinand, Blockers, and Bumblebee. He was an F9 as Jacob Toretto, returned for Fast X, and played Peacemaker in The Suicide Squad and its TV series. Number 27, Carl Urban, 6 foot 1 or 185 centimeters. He had TV roles, including in White Fang. Carl's major roles include Aomer in Lord of the Rings the trilogy, Dr. Leonard Bones McCoy in Star Trek, William Cooper in Red, and Judge Dredd in Dredd. Number 26, Keanu Reeves, 6 foot 1 or 186 centimeters. In 2014, Keanu Reeves starred in John Wick, a hit with critics and audiences. He brought the character back in John Wick Chapter 2, which opened even stronger and got rave reviews. Number 25, Pierce Brosnan, 6 foot 1 or 186 centimeters. He's famous for playing the lead in Remington Steel and for being James Bond in movies like GoldenEye, Tomorrow Never Dies, The World Is Not Enough, and die another day. Number 24, Tom Hiddleston, 6 foot 1 or 187 centimeters. Hiddleston gained fame for playing Loki in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Beyond Marvel, he's also had a varied career in theater, TV, and movies. Number 23, Arnold Schwarzenegger, 6 foot 2 or 188 centimeters. Schwarzenegger charmed audiences in Pumping Iron, leading to Conan the Barbarian and his international stardom with The Terminator. Over two decades, he started sequels and became an iconic figure. Number 22, Ben Affleck, six foot two or 188 centimeters. Affleck rose to fame writing and starring in Good Will Hunting with Matt Damon, snagging an Oscar. He then became a household name with the blockbuster Armageddon. Number 21, Chris Pratt, six foot two or 188 centimeters. Pratt, initially known from Parks and Recreation, gained major fame as the quirky Peter Quill of Star-Lord in Marvel's Guardians of the Galaxy. Number 20, Gerard Butler, 6 foot 2 or 188 centimeters. In 2007, he hit the spotlight as King Leonidas in 300 and appeared in Shattered. He also joined Hilary Swank in P.S. I Love You. Recently, he's been in movies like Gods of Egypt, Geostorm, and Hunter Killer. Number 19, Idris Elba, 6 foot 2 inches or 189 centimeters. Elba made a name for himself in HBO's The Wire as the smart drug kingpin Stringer Bell. He later diversified into comedy in The Office and romance in The Big C. Number 18, Jean Reno, 6 foot 2 or 188 centimeters. Reno has been in major American movies like French Kiss, Mission Impossible, Ronin, and Godzilla working with stars like Meg Ryan, Tom Cruise, and Robert De Niro. Number 17, Jim Carrey, 6 foot 2 or 188 centimeters. The twice Golden Globe winning actor first got noticed on In Living Color. He then made a big splash with lead roles in Ace Ventura Pet Detective, Dumb and Dumber, and The Mask, proving himself as a hit comedy star. Number 16, John Travolta, 6 foot 2 or 188 centimeters. Travolta began on TV and then moved to films. He's won an Emmy and a Golden Globe and been up for two Oscars, a BAFTA, and three SAG Awards. He also got an Emmy nod for his role in Die Hard. Number 15, Morgan Freeman, 6 foot 2 or 188 centimeters. Morgan Freeman, a versatile actor, has done everything from children's TV to Shakespeare. He's famous for roles in films like Driving Miss Daisy, Lean on Me, Glory, and Million Dollar Baby. Number 14, Ryan Reynolds, 
6 foot 2 or 188 centimeters. Ryan Reynolds is known for a mix of roles, from comedic in Van Wilder and waiting to action-packed in Green Lantern and Deadpool. Number 13. Samuel L. Jackson, 6 foot 2 or 189 centimeters. He joined the MCU as Nick Fury, signing a nine-movie deal that included hits like Iron Man 2, The Avengers, and Avengers Endgame. Number 12. Will Smith, 6 foot 2 or 188 centimeters. He's a four-time Grammy-winning rapper. Smith gained more fame as the star of Bad Boys and Men in Black, and continued his success in their sequels. Number 11. Chris Hemsworth, 6 foot 3 or 191 centimeters. He first got noticed in Australia playing Kim Hyde in Home and Away from 2004 to 2007. His big break was landing the role of Thor in the 2011 Marvel movie, catapulting him to fame. Number 10. Dave Batista, 6 foot 3 or 190 centimeters. Batista's major acting break was as Drax in Marvel's Guardians of the Galaxy. He continued this role in more MCU movies and landed big roles in films like Spectre and Blade Runner 2049. Number 9. Hugh Jackman, 6 foot 3 or 190 centimeters. He's famous for playing Wolverine in the X-Men series and starring in movies like Kate and Leopold and The Prestige. Jackman is also a talented singer and dancer in stage musicals, winning a Tony Award for The Boys from Oz. Number 8. Michael Shannon, 6 foot 3 or 191 centimeters. Michael Shannon is widely recognized for his compelling roles in movies like The Shape of Water and Revolutionary Road, which brought him his first Oscar nomination. Number 7. Paul Bettany, 6 foot 3 or 191 centimeters. He's known for playing Jarvis and Vision in the Marvel movies like Iron Man and Avengers Infinity War, and continued the role in the Disney Plus series WandaVision. Number 6. Ray Stevenson, 6 foot 3 or 191 centimeters. His TV work includes playing Isaac Serko in Dexter, Blackbeard in Black Sails, voice acting Gar Saxon in the Star Wars animated series, and appearing as Balin Skoll in Ashoka. Number 5. Alexander Skarsgård, 6 foot 4 or 194 centimeters. He built up a decade of acting work in Sweden before making it big as Eric Northman in HBO's True Blood. Post True Blood, Skarsgård took on diverse roles in Hidden, The Legend of Tarzan, and Big Little Lies. Number 4. Bill Skarsgård, 6 foot 4 or 192 centimeters. He's most recognized for playing Pennywise in the horror movies It and It Chapter 2 based on Stephen King's novel. He's also voiced Crow in the Marvel movie Eternals. Number 3. Jason Momoa, 6 foot 4 or 194 centimeter. He started his career with Baywatch and Stargate Atlantis and gained fame as Cal Drago in Game of Thrones. He later debuted as Aquaman. Number 2. Jeff Goldblum, 6 foot 4 or 194 centimeters. He's been in huge hits like Jurassic Park and Independence Day, along with their sequels. He's also known as the Grandmaster in Marvel's Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2, Thor Ragnarok, and the Disney Plus series, What If? Number 1. Dwayne Johnson, 6 foot 5 or 196 centimeters. Johnson's first big role was in The Scorpion King in 2002, netting him $5.5 million. He's since starred in films like The Rundown, Walking Tall, the game plan, and faster. And there you have it. From towering talents to those with a more modest stature, each brings their own unique presence to the silver screen. We hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell to catch more fascinating countdowns and insights. Alright, that's it for today. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.